we're doing a vlog. The vlog is going to be post crash Kyle. Post crash Kyle. And everything. So I just listed my moto van for sale today. How do you feel about this? I think it's great. I think it's a great idea. She's very excited. I'm very excited for you. Moving cool. on to the next chapter. Just because she hated the previous chapter. I love the previous chapter. <laughs> Stupid. Commodore, how do you feel about this? You seem inquisitive. You're unsure about it. And now you have accepted it. I'm to look at so providing another update today is May 2nd. Um, doing better, surprisingly. It's, it, it kind of gets old saying, I'm getting better, I feel better every day, but it's amazing how many things I've lost that I have to regain. I went swimming today, I tried it. So you can see my, my brace over here is now drying. Um, swimming would have been good if it was like warm in the pool. It was really freaking cold, so didn't really swim. I just kind of like froze my butt off and then got out. But um, everything is getting easier. It's only appropriate that when I wrecked, this noise would have went off. It's pretty much what happened. Luckily, I had an extra one plus life. So um, I must have used that. Finally getting rid of my poop extender. Yep. Thank goodness we are finally done with this thing. This thing is terrible and miserable. It's so nice to use a regular toilet. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. So it's a sad day. I'm gonna go sell my motor van. <laughs> and unfortunately, I've also got to figure out how to, how to how I'm gonna drive it. But anyways, part of the, I guess it's a necessary step won't be able to use this for at least a year, so no, no point in just letting it sit here. So we're gonna, got a, um, luckily a, a really cool guy that's interested in it, that wants to do a conversion. So, um, you know, this fits, fits exactly what he's looking for and we've got a, you know, good base started, but it's kind of weird. It's completely empty back here. All my stuff's out. So time to go get it sold. Shreves. It's May 5th, how am I doing? How's my recovery going? So extra and you need to strip? What was, <laughs> what's going no, on? It's just, it's very warm by the cooking, the uh, cooking flames. Uh, we don't use flames, we use electricity, so. All right, you're crazy. So look, it's my brace, it's my turtle shell. It's not on me. I've been walking around with no turtle shell and no neck brace, it's great. I even drove. And you're not supposed to do any of those things. You I'm supposed to do what I'm capable of and I'm doing no, what I'm capable of. No, you are defying explicit doctor orders. <laughs> nope, <laughs> nope, me. That's what I have to say to that. These cats agree too. Huh, Commodore? Huh, meow meow. Interesting fact, turtle shells go on much easier on dress clothes because they're tailored and stay tighter to your body. Therefore, all of the fabric doesn't get all caught up in the seams. So now I know, she's in one dress shirt. 